So you want a diesel, you want four wheel drive, you want a collection option or a side discharge option, well look no further because we've got the Kubota GR2120s. We're Machinery Nation and we bring you videos every Tuesday and Friday all about tools and machinery. Let's get cracking. Tested by Machinery Nation. So both these lawn tractors are pretty much the same, apart from the deck option and obviously the collecting mode has got the collection box on the back. They both come with Kubota's 21 horsepower three cylinder diesel engine. Four wheel drive as standard, hydrostatic drive, hydraulic deck lift, seat belt and ROPS protection, and shaft drive from the engine to the deck. My favourite feature on the 2120s is the steering. For one, it's power steering, so really nice and easy. But it's also got something called glide steer, which means as you steer the wheel round, it'll stop the inner wheel turning so that you're not, one, scuffing the ground, and two, it makes a much tighter lock on the steering. So the collection version comes with a 450 litre grass collector, a three bladed cutting deck, so as it cuts the grass, it sends the grass back up through the middle of the machine, underneath the seat, directly into the collector. A grass flapper at the throat of the machine to clear any blockages on the deck, and one on the rear of the chute to throw any blockages right back into the grass box. Right, so set the cutting height. You've got between one and four inches to choose from, and I've gone for 1.75 and see how we get on. So let's start her up, engage the blades, put the deck down, and get cutting. Oh, oh. And we're away. Well, obviously, if you're under trees, you can fold down the rock frame. That is an absolute pleasure to use, and what a cracking job it's done. So now time for the side discharge option, which is also available with a mulching kit. So you can convert this to a mulching mower. Today, we are just using it as a side discharge. So cut the grass, chuck it out the side. In a minute, we'll try some longer grass as well. Right, long grass test. We all know that you like to go into long grass every now and again. So, collector up first, and then the side discharge. Let's do it. Right, I'm going to send them three and a half inches on the height. Let's see what they do. Woo! Up with the revs. In with the drive. Whoa! 
down with the deck. Whoop, whoop. Rocking and rolling. Well, we're not we're mowing, aren't we? Close to wet. Doing a good job. Look at that! Brilliant job. Done a great job by saying the side discharge actually cuts a little bit higher at three and a half inches than what the collector does, but that's probably just how they were set up in PDI or in the factory. nicest features about this mower is the mowing in reverse function. Yes, nearly all mowers you can mow in reverse with, but since several years ago, they've all had to have a feature where you press a button before reversing. And there's only a few on the market where you actually press the button once, once you start mowing and then leave it. Most mowers, you've got to press it every time you reverse, and it's very easy to forget. Where this one, you just press it once, once you've engaged the blades, and then you don't have to press it again until you start mowing again. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> So some of you might not require the rollover protection system, the ROP system, which is the seatbelt and the rollover protection. But for a few years now, the legislation has been around that all machines over 400 kilograms have got to have that, whereas years ago they didn't need it. So they're four wheel drive, but how four wheel drive are they? Let's find out. If it went down, let's see if it'll go back up again. Woo! No problem. Steeper. Right, a bit steeper. We'll give it a whirl. Oh, she spun a little bit, but she's still going. <laughs> yeah. Can she coat down it as well? Oh, yes, she can. <laughs> well, I better try it with the collector as well, haven't we? Right, straight in for the steep one. No problemo. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. I would say I really like both of these machines. They have been super. The power that, that is pushing down to the blades on both machines is incredible. That three cylinder, 21 horsepower engine is certainly doing its job. Really, really pleased with both of them. The four wheel drive capabilities, the traction on those slopes, phenomenal. Absolutely outstanding. I did not expect them to do that. It's just equal amounts of grip on all four wheels. It did not question going up those banks. So well happy with that. The comfort, nice, happy. The collection ability on the collector, excellent. Side discharge on the 48 inch deck on that one, brilliant. I can't pinpoint a negative on either of them. Absolute superb machines. And if you'd like a demonstration for them, Kubota have got a dealer network nationwide that you can click onto their website, which the link is in the description for you to check them out. But we're Machinery Nation and we bring you videos every Tuesday and Friday all about tools and machinery. So please consider subscribing, hit the like button and ding the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Cheerio. Long grass time.